Hey farmers, what's going on? Welcome back to another very special Haiti video. In this video, we're going to be playing our next valley season, which is valley season 23. So let's get started with our game. I'm just going to harvest uh, a bunch of these crops. going to check my visitors over here. And all right, now before I start playing this season, let's have a look at the decoration. This is a decoration that we're going to be getting from this season. And that is a goat samurai, which I really love. And I think it's really cool. It has to be one of my most favorite decorations in the valley. I think it's been influenced by the ancient Japanese culture. Which is a very awesome fact. So yeah, this decoration is really cool. It seems like a goat having a sword and you know, it's maybe it's practicing something. Now let's just get to the valley and start playing it. All right, so you can see over here, the valley board has been refreshed and I'm just gonna tap on it and boom, it's gonna take me to the next valley, which is right here. All right, awesome. Now the only bad thing about this valley is that it's the chicken's valley, which I don't really like to do a lot of work. And it's honestly very boring. So I'm in the valley and I don't really see anything too special, just like the usual area with lots of trucks and lots of buildings. So let's have a look at what are we having from this valley. So we have a performer goat, which is a decoration, and we have to collect about 100 chickens. Nice, there's only 20 days left as usual, 30 diamonds and some boosters as well. So let's have a look at the prizes. Now I probably won't be able to play the valley because I don't like really have a lot of time for this. So, so I'm probably gonna miss this as well, but that doesn't matter anyway. So I'm getting one expansion per main, that's two puzzle pieces, uh, two, three, oh my God, that's three expansion permits and one, two, three. Uh, I think three puzzle pieces. Yeah, that's actually a lot of good stuff that I'm getting from the valley. And so, okay. Uh, what about my goals for today? So these are some of the daily quests. I'll do them later. So I'm just going to get started. Let's just spin the wheel and start driving, start collecting some stuff and see how it goes. All right. I got seven fuel and I'm not going to respin. Just going to have a look at my daily goals. Uh, feed cows, produce one fish lore and plant some cotton. So let's just complete our goals. Uh, let's see what do we have for tomorrow. So tomorrow ones are very simple. Okay, so cotton, I just hope that I do have. Yep, I do have a lot of cotton, so I'm just going to plant all that. Let me just do this. Yeah, there we go. I'm just going to plant all that, and it's going to get me a lot of points there. The next was to feed cows. Oh my god, what? Okay, yeah, I, I think I do have feed. So just going to feed my cows, and that's going to... Give me some points as well. There we go. Let's make more feed. Um, all right. And I'm going to make some fish lures. So let's just go to the fishing area and start creating some lures. All right. So let's make four lures there. That's a lot of points I've collected. Now it's time to just spin the wheel and collect more fuel. So let's see how much fuel do we get this time. I really hope it's nine. I want to get more. And that's going to be... Oh, okay, seven again. I'm just gonna spin it slow this time, and let's see how much do we get this time. Wow, are you kidding me? Six? Nope, that's not cool. That's not cool at all. It's gonna be my last chance, and I wanna get... Ah, uh, I didn't get nine. I'm just getting six and seven. That's a really bad start. Okay, so I have to collect um 169 more points for my next fuel, which I'll do later, hopefully, and I'm not going to spend diamonds. So the next thing is just to drive the truck. Now, the only thing you have to do in this valley is just to collect the chickens, uh, just like, you know, you collect your animals in the valley, uh, the sanctuary valley. Other things are pretty much the same. You've got your daily quests, um, you've got your, you know, lucky bonus and mystery boxes there. So let's just start driving the truck. Let me have a look at where's my truck. I think I just saw it here. Yep, there we go. The rainbow truck. And let's complete some otters. That's going to be one fuel. And oops, I don't have any raspberries. Wow, that's just not nice. That's bad. Oh, that was so frustrating when I don't have anything. I don't want to get back. Like, imagine you're going to complete otters out of city and then you just don't have that thing. That is just so frustrating. All right, I'm just going to do more. There we go. And wait, that's that's not my truck, right? Oh, I just got really misconfused because I saw this truck driving. I was like, wait, this is not my truck. That was really funny. Let's go to the fish store and complete some otters here. Four carrots for 14 green and two tokens. Another thing that I've noticed in the Chicken's Valley is you don't get a lot of tokens. 
Seriously, when you complete otters in the sanctuary valley, you get a lot of tokens, like even 20 to 30 of the tokens. But in this valley, you just get like 8 to 9, maybe a maximum of 10. Oh, look at this. There are 40 points. Man, was I wrong? I don't know, but like most of the times, the tokens are actually very low. And like that's the main challenge. You just have to collect a lot of tokens. And what they do, they put a lot of good stuff in the chicken's value because they know people won't be able to collect a lot of tokens. Like, seriously, you have to collect 1,100 at least if you want to get the decoration. And then there's other good things that you have to purchase. So imagine the amount of tokens and amount of time you have to spend playing this valley. It's just so boring. But I'm still not finding any chickens. Like, seriously, chickens are not even a problem for me, to be honest, because my other neighbors and, you know, the other players that are playing this valley, they collect the chickens. And even if I don't, I still complete this valley and I still win the prizes, which I think is a good thing. Um, because not everybody has active neighbors. And I think neighborhood matters a lot in these things. So, um, okay, my daily quest has been completed. Let's just open the mystery box. And we just got a blue voucher. Very nice. Where's my truck? Here it is. I am going to, let's see, where can I go? Well, it seems like I'm stuck. I think I'm just going to turn this way. Um, I really don't want to complete the the orders, the delivery requests, because they're not my cup of tea. I'm just going to skip them. So let's go over here to this place. And I wish there were some changes in the valley. Like, seriously, it's been the same since it's added. There's nothing new. Look at this massive rock, like stone. What is it? Okay, now it's time to go to this road and... Like, I drive randomly. I know some people have a specific sequence that they follow when they're driving their trucks, but, like, I don't. I just randomly complete them. Maybe it's their strategy, but my strategy is very simple in the valley. Or I should say, I don't follow any strategies in the valley. I just play it randomly. Just to complete the orders to, you know, get enough tokens so that I can get the decoration. That's all I want. Okay, um, one cookie. There we go. Seven more fuel left, and... I think I've collected like 105 green tokens, which is cool. Oh my god, I don't have any cacaos. Let's get back to my farm and harvest some cacaos. Oh, wait, I was not going to expand my farm right now. We're just going to get back and I'm just going to complete this otter very well. Let's come over here and do this one. Wait, did I just spend four fields instead of two? I think I, I, think I tapped twice. I don't know. All right, there we go. So three more fields left, and I think I'm going to have to stop really soon. So that's probably going to be my last order. Uh, this one, the store, one milk. And, yep, I am officially done in the valley right now. I need to get more, and I don't want to spend diamonds just to get the token. So that was all about this valley. Actually, it's just so many clouds. But I do love the decoration this time, this performer, samurai kind of gold. It's really, really cool. All right, so we're back at my farm, and I think I'm just going to do some work. Let's collect some, actually, very few coins. Oh, there's still some more coins. Okay, there we go. Let's um, have a look at the boat otter. Yeah, I'm going to do that. So that's some corn dogs. There's a fish soup, and there's hand pies. Let's just ask for help there. I'm going to collect my honeycombs. Let's just wake up my pets quickly. There we go. Let's come over here to my... Donkeys, gonna feed my puppies now. Let's come over here to my um, kittens. Um, the dogs, I'm getting a lot of stuff. The cats, and of course, the horses. Okay, um, yeah, I think that's done. I'm just gonna collect some dairy and I'm gonna make more cream and butter. Seems like I don't have enough milk, but I do have a lot of dairy products. I think I need to make more stuff. Uh, let's just run my sauce maker. I'm gonna put some soy sauce. I need more olives. Look at my two tiny, tiny plants. They are so cute, but when they grow up, they become ugly. Seriously, I don't like growing up olive trees. They just look so weird. I love when they're little. Like, they're so little, like, so small, you know? And when they grow up, they're, like, giants. It's crazy. Um, okay, let's make more stuff. I think I'm doing well on the sugars. Just gonna put a bunch of the white sugars there. I think that'll be helpful. Yep, and let's collect some more stuff that I can do. And 
Oh, I've got more visitors here. Hi, Greg. How are you doing? It's been a long time since I've seen you. Greetings. Let's do business. Okay, there you go. Enjoy your cabbage. Hello, got this in stock. Yes, Mike, I have this in my stock, but I'm sorry. They're too rare to sell them to you. So, nope, just go away. Look at my cat. She's so cute. Um, So, I think everything has been done. And I'm just going to end the video right here. That was all about the Valley Season 23. The decoration this time is a performer goat, which is really cool. So make sure you guys play this Valley and don't miss this. Let me know in the comments what stuff you're getting from the prizes. Are you getting more expansion permits? Are more puzzle pieces? Are nothing? I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any more Haiti videos coming. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.